there's different levels of happiness because you can either be really, really happy or kind of happy or kind of sad. It kind of depends. No, you just it's just one level. You're happy or you're not. I think there can be different levels. I think, you know, obviously there's like ecstatic where like you're unbelievably happy. Um, but I don't think that, you know, any level of happiness is better than the next. Um, yes, I think there are. I think that, um, yeah. I think it is a very difficult concept, but I mean, it can be measured in, uh, to me, it's just an inner peace, you know, it's something that, that I've, that I've kind of achieved over my life. I'm involved in a lot of soccer and just being out there on the field and playing soccer makes me happy. I find I do my passion, I dance, I do a lot of different things. I come to school. I mean, that's not really happy, but I don't know. Outside of school, I guess. Um, I do a lot of things. I can um, play sports, read, uh, hang out with my friends, lots of things. Uh, to make myself happy, I guess I surround myself with people who don't bring me down and I do the things I enjoy. like. Photography and soccer, I guess. So there's a lot of things that make me happy that don't require me doing anything, such as being around my family um, and being with people who love me, being around my friends. Um, there are things that bring me pleasure that I do like to do, and that's such as teaching Spanish, speaking Spanish, playing the guitar, and surfing are like my favorite things to do, and reading. So those things bring me a measure of happiness. people are happy it makes me happy because I sometimes think that um, happiness is kind of contagious and um, when other people are happy it just makes me feel good because they're happy. Well they can let me play with them and make me laugh. Um, one thing that I really love is when other people are content or happy especially if I do something for them and I see that they're grateful for it. That's a big thing. Um. I, to make me happy, I like seeing other people generous to one another, doing kind things for one another, and helping each other out. Give me food, <laughs> um, be nice to me, and I think people who have good taste in music make people happy. Um, well, they can, um, if you get hurt, they can help you, and um, it might help you up if, it, if you fall down and you get real hurt really bad and you have like a boo-boo or something. Um, I think that it means to be happy, like when someone's happy, they're, they've done everything that they've wanted to do, they're like content in life, they've, um, they're, they're doing what they want to do and they're around people that they like and everything's kind of working out for them. It means like we're having fun. It means to feel good inside, to feel like you could do anything, you know. To be happy probably means that you're enjoying your life and when you wake up in the morning, you're totally down to get out of bed and actually get dressed and make an effort to do something productive rather than, you know, sit around and be on Netflix all day. Usually if you're happy, you're not going to do that. Um, well it's like, um, you feel good, um, you sometimes smile. Um, I think happiness is a feeling that comes when you're content, whether whether it's just if you're homeless or something and you have food, that's contentness, or even if you get something or a good grade when you work hard for it. If you play with them, they're happy. Yeah. How are things happy um, from feeling good about what you see and what things are going on in and around you. 
when I'm in Hawaii, I miss surfing like clean, glassy waves. A lot of, a lot of days when I surf, it's a cheap glass. And, and then when I'm in Bali, I miss surfing piping back door and off the wall. Like there's nowhere else in the world that compares to those two waves. Thank you.